Hello everybody, James Blackburn here. Today's daily video is not going to be as fun and exciting and an adventure, and I apologize in advance, but I call it the James Blackburn Experience for a reason, and that is because it literally follows my life experiences. And most of the time things are positive and uplifting and fun, but it's not like that all the time. Uh, we all know that sometimes life can be rough, and today's video is all about that. <sighs> let's, let's just do it. I, I guess I just got to tell you guys. Lost a friend today. A friend I've known for 17 years. A friend that I've seen on almost a daily basis. This friend always greeted me with a smile and unconditional love. And it's hard to say goodbye when you become close to someone. And I know some of you are going to think this is silly, but I consider humans my friends and I consider animals my friends as well. And for those of you who've had pets in your life, you know that you get bonded and very close to them. And when they have to go, it's, it's sad. So today was the last day of life for my neighbor's dog, Shadow. And I know you're thinking, why, why does it bother me? But that dog was awesome. He, he, like I said, every day I'd go over and say hello, I'd pet the dog, scratch him on the head, and he was always happy. And, and he had this unconditional love for, for the humans around him. And, you know, I'm smiling a little bit thinking about how awesome the dog was, but I'm sad at the same time that he's no longer here. So my condolences to my neighbors and, and the family for the loss of your, your your family member and your pet. And, you know, let this be a lesson for all of us, And I guess. And that is, you know, love is unconditional when you truly and honestly love somebody. And we can learn from our pets what that is like. And, you know, I, I'm sad. And I've already done my crying over it. And I'm sad that Shadow's gone. But... 17 years is a long time for a dog, and I'm so glad I got to know him and, you know, give the dog an extra friend in life, because he, he lived with an awesome family, and then he had his neighbors that were also friends, so, you know, he's going to be missed. But I don't want this to be all sad and, and all a downer for you folks, so right now I'm going to share with you some more unconditional love. First of all, I have unconditional love for all the true and honest and good things on this planet but I also am lucky enough to have this right here this is Angel this is my cat she is 19 years old and she is getting up there too so she's not gonna be around forever but right now she's here and she's still awesome and she's my baby cake so we're gonna take good care of her while she's here as well and like I said this cat, she has unconditional love, just like I do for her. So, All right, folks, well, tune back tomorrow. I'll do something different for a video, and it won't be such a downer. Uh, but I had to talk about this today because it, it really weighs on you when you have to say goodbye to a friend. So to my neighbors and their pet, Shadow, thank you for 17 wonderful years of having a dog and for being able to call that dog my friend. So... Thanks, folks. I hope that all of you are having a great day. And as usual, love, love, hate, hate. And if you have any questions or comments, you can leave them by there for me. So.